Hi, my name is Gustavo Silveira and this is the DIY MIDI controller workshop from the Nerd Musician. This is a free course where I'm going to teach you how to build your MIDI controllers really easily using the Arduino platform. I'm a Brazilian multimedia artist and maker. I'm currently doing my master in music technology in Georgia Southern University and I've been building uh, MIDI controllers for a couple years now. And I call them my MIDI controllers as beat controllers and I've been making a lot of uh, custom made controllers uh, worldwide. And I have a blog that's called Musico Nerd or The Nerd Musician. I first started this blog in Brazil where I come from and I've been doing a lot of tutorials uh, related to music, programming, uh, electronics and other uh, nerd music related content. And I decided this time to make uh, the content English because a lot of people uh, has been asking me to, to do this content so more people could understand. So what are you going to learn? You're going to learn how to make your own MIDI controllers using the Arduino platform so they can uh, connect to other synthesizers with other digital audio workstations uh, or even uh, VJ softwares, DJ softwares, photo editing softwares and anything that can actually accept MIDI. You will learn what is an Arduino and what it can do for you. You're gonna learn how to make a circuit on the breadboard that's pretty easy to do because you don't need any experience on soldering, so it's really beginner friendly. And you're gonna learn how to upload the code to your Arduino so it can become a MIDI controller and you learn how to edit this code to suit your needs. So let's get started. So what is MIDI? MIDI stands for Music Instrument Digital Interface. It was created as a protocol so different synthesizers could communicate between each other. So this way not only synthesizers could communicate between each other but also synthesizers with computers like with digital audio workstations and with mixers or nowadays with a variety of things like VJ softwares, DJ softwares and even photo editing softwares for example. MIDI was standardized in 1983 and although it's a pretty old protocol, it's widely used nowadays and is still the standard for uh, communication between uh, musical instruments. It can carry information as notes, velocity, contour change, pitch band and a variety of other things. With time, companies started to develop more and more MIDI controllers. And MIDI controllers are nothing more, nothing less than interfaces or instruments that can send MIDI protocol. It became very popular among electronic musicians and DJs, VJs and studio engineers because it's super powerful, really flexible and is much cheaper than, for example, buying an actual analog synthesizer. So you can buy a MIDI controller that is super cheap, depending of course, but it's probably cheaper than an analog synthesizer and control one software inside your computer. However, sometimes they don't have exactly what we need or they are more expensive that we can or you want to pay. Fortunately, with technology it became much easier to make your own MIDI controller and much cheaper than buying a MIDI controller from a store for example. And this way you can make your own MIDI controllers the way you want and spending much less money than buying a MIDI controller uh, with a famous brand, for example. And one of the easiest ways of building your own MIDI controller is using an Arduino.